Hi, this is Munson with Munson Music. I'm going to talk about how you can play a song called Where Did Our Love Go by the Supremes. And it starts out on a C major chord. And when you play C major, first finger goes to the B on the first fret, second finger on the D string, second fret, and third finger on the A string, third fret. And if you strum the A string to the high E string, that sounds a C major chord and it sounds really happy. Now while you're on C's in general, it can be kind of cool to lift off the first finger and make that a C major 7. Or you could add the pinky in on the B string third and make that a C major 9. And then from the C, we're going to be going to a G major chord. We play G major. First finger goes to A on the second fret. Second finger on the low E string third fret. And third finger on the high E string third fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds a G major chord and it sounds really happy. Now you may also want to think about putting the third finger on the B string third, pinky on the high E string third. How work in that for your G major? And then from our G, we go to a D minor chord. First finger goes to the high E on the first fret, second finger on the G string second fret, and the third of the fourth finger on the B string third fret. And if you strum the D string to the high E string, that sounds a D minor chord and it sounds really sad. Now, if you're doing that with one, two, and three, you could kind of lift off the first finger to make that a D sus or D sus two, or you could add the pinky in on the high E string to make that a D suspended and kind of say some things around the D minor. And then from the D minor, we go back to our G major chord, and then at the very end, we go to an F major chord. Normally you do this as a first fret bar, and we'll talk about an easy way to play this too. But then second finger on the G string second, third finger on the A third, and the pinky on the D third. And if you strum all those together, that sounds an F major chord, and it sounds really, really happy. Now you may also want to think about using something called F major seven, where you do the first finger on the B string first fret, second finger on the G string second fret, and third finger on the D string third fret. And if you strum the D string to the high E string, that sounds an F major seven, and it sounds really, really great. Through the song, though, you may want to kind of gravitate to kind of an eight down idea, and it kind of swings a little bit, um, but that can be kind of a cool idea, and I'm kind of doing a little bit of muting, so that might be kind of a cool way to kind of intro the tune, it's kind of just doing eight downs on each of the chords, G, F, the end. Or one of my favorite strum patterns for a 4-4 four, four light, this is down, down, up, up, down, up. So to the C and tried that a lot, you'd have down, down, up. down of the down down up up down up you can throw a bass note in for the chord so on the c you'd have the a for the bass on the g you'd have the e for the bass and on the d minor you'd have the d for the bass and on the f bar you'd have low e for the bass and on the f major seven you'd have the d for the bass so we tried it that way kind of adding basses we'd have c see what you can say with it too.
there's almost like a stop time idea on the T. So right after that T, you may want to hit it down and kind of kill some time and then come back in. But that's the basics of how you can strum through Where Did Our Love Go by The Supreme. So, good luck!